Good morning, you guys. Welcome back to our channel. Today, we are packing our family to go on a family trip to Nashville. We are going for an MPS conference, which is our son's terminal diagnosis. If you are new here, our son is diagnosed with Sampolipo syndrome, which is MPS type 3A. Sampolipo syndrome is a degenerative terminal illness, and it's also known as childhood Alzheimer's. A vacation like this isn't necessarily a beachy, relaxing vacation, but family conferences like this, especially if you go to a world World Conference is where you get to meet doctors, researchers, other families, etc. And this family conference, it's going to be mainly meeting other families and getting to reconnect again, which is such a special, special time. I could go into a whole bunch more this vlog, but I am going to actually pack some vlogging supplies to take with us and break up our trip a little bit into a few fun vlogs. So I hope you can follow us while we're there and you can follow us over on Instagram if you would like to see our trip. But for today, you are just going to pack with me. So as far as packing goes today, I am trying to fit all of us into two suitcases. I really wanted to do just one, but I was like, Shelby, you can take two, it's fine. We chose to drive to Nashville instead of fly due to the price difference. It is dad and I going, as well as Owen, big sister Paisley, and baby Wren. So I am taking Wren because I'm still breastfeeding her and we are leaving our toddler of a boy home with Nana. He's gonna have so much fun here. As much as I am and we are going to miss him so, so much. This is like our first time away from him. Um, He's obviously gonna have much more fun here playing, going to the pool, going to the park, and we just won't have to deal with chasing him around during all the conferences and such. So it's gonna work out better this way. But like I said, we are trying to pack everybody into two suitcases. Um, our older daughter Paisley is taking her own bag, so on my end it is a little bit easier and not have to pack her up. But we did FaceTime last night just to be sure she had everything she needed and do a quick little run through our list and double check everything. So I am such a list maker and I have clearly enjoyed making a whole long list of everything we need with every little detail. Literally the feeling of just checking things off the list is just the best feeling in the world. So I've been having fun doing that. I've spent the last two days kind of gathering everything and kind of put it together, but I am here with the kids all day by myself. So I've been trying to do it like around nap time or early bedtime because let's face it, by the time bedtime rolls around, I am ready for bed as well. But yeah, we have a snack bag. We are not taking a cooler because we are going to find a store once we get there and pick up the cold items that we need once we see like the freezer fridge situation. But we are taking some snacks for the road. I'll just kind of show you what I have going. And like I said, this is all you're gonna see. This vlog is me packing for our trip to Nashville. So while we're there, we do have an itinerary full of fun for the family conference. Um, we are actually arriving the day before just to get in and get settled, get comfortable in our hotel room. And then the next morning, everything starts. So they are feeding us breakfast, lunch, and dinner, buffet meals each day. That's part of our registration. And then we can eat anywhere we want in between if we have some time. But mainly during the days, Owen can go to the kids camp, which is called Camp Courage if he would like, or if we would like him to. There's all different kinds of conferences during the day, all different times. So we try and plan out the ones we wanna go to. We'll have to somehow work in the kids' naps, but we'll make it work, I don't know. As of right now, I'm just trying to plan out our day based on our itinerary. So like I said, during the day, I'm just trying to be comfortable. We're gonna be sitting, taking notes, meeting other families, giving lots of hugs, I'm hoping. And then one night we get a night on the town in Nashville as an option. So after conferences are over, we'll go back to the hotel, freshen up a little bit and get dressed up a little bit if we want to. Oh, yeah. But we'll see how far um, the kiddos let me get today with packing. So I did order a handful of things from Amazon for our trip. I did order myself a couple of dresses because I just wanted something 
comfy and loose fitting as I'm still like postpartum whatever and um, I just feel bloated all the time guys so I don't want to wear I had in mind like some spandex shorts and a big t-shirt for like one of the days even the travel day and I was just like I don't want to wear stuff that's like tight. All about the dresses this trip. So we're just going to get all of our bags together and start putting things away. I think I'm going to organize one suitcase with just Owen and Ren and then the other suitcase with Dad and I. Um, I think that'll be the easiest. And then like I said, we have a snack bag and Owen has his personal little Toy Story bag that he takes with all of his um, goodies for the car in so should we pack sure sure I love you mm -hmm. I'm gonna miss you mm -hmm. will you call us every day yeah. five times a day yeah cuz I'm gonna miss you so much mm -hmm. you're gonna have fun with me <laughs> get our suitcases. Okay. Okay. Bye. <laughs> Bye. Come on. Come on. Pack. We're gonna pack. <laughs> We're gonna go on a trip. Trip? Yeah. And Jude's gonna stay here with Nana.
George is already in his homemade Owen shirt. <laughs> this is just his O with the glasses, I think. Here you go. Here is the symbol that it's supposed to be. <laughs> But we made George a little shirt to wear on big MPS trips or days so that way he can fit right in. George, you're so handsome, all clean, all dressed, and ready to go. Okay, so it's a few hours later, but we got a lot accomplished. Again, we have our toiletry bag. I'm going to link this one below. I researched forever on finding a good family size toiletry bag and I'm in love with this one. I'm just going to open it real quick to show you. It actually hangs on your door pretty easily. I have all my jewelry here for this trip. This is all of our main toiletries and our medications. Sister and I's hair stuff and then our toothbrushes. So <laughs> yep, hair stuff. We only had so many of those packing cubes, which I highly recommend getting, but these are all of Dad's clothes that he needs. Two hats. We're taking our steamer because I'm taking some dresses. Um, this is Dad's personal toiletry bag here that he has. I have a cover-up. My clothes here. And then this is just a bag with like hair straightener and um, some extra bigger toiletry things, I guess. So there is dad and I's bag. Okay, so the kids suitcase is on the opposite end of the table. I just found it easier to go back and forth and put them on either side here. So again, Owen and Ren are going to share a suitcase. These are all of Owen's clothes. These are all of Ren's clothes. Both have pajamas packed in there. Like I said, these packing cubes are such a lifesaver. Um, you can get them off Amazon and I will link these below. We have two of our stroller cup holders here, just so I wouldn't forget them. We have um, the stroller fan for sister, and then we have um, this bag I put together for our stroller specifically, and it literally just has anything that I wanna take with us downstairs from the hotel. So diapers, wipes, a burp rag, we can put our money in here, but that way we don't have to lug like the whole diaper bag. It's getting late, kids are getting whiny. I'm <laughs> trying my best here to finish up because dad's gonna wanna load up the car as soon as he gets home. So I have all his sister's toys that she can play with here, her couple pairs of shoes. I have Owen's melatonin here because he can open the cap, so I need to put that somewhere where it's safe. <laughs> I have a couple washcloths and then Owen's silverware in here. Um, this has Owen's socks and underwear and a couple wet bags for our travel home or if we need them in the hotel or with the stroller. Um, this suitcase is amazing because this side actually unzips bigger. So in this pocket, we just have some extra things to do in the hotel, um, all of sister's diapers for the week. I am packing two of Owen's um, Depends just in case we have an accident or something happens. I'd rather be prepared than not. We probably won't use them, but like I said, it's always good to be prepared. This is any feeding stuff for yeah. sis that we'll need, and then this is all of our vlogging materials. So anyways, this is just a nice extra pocket to have here. I'll zip that back up here in a second. Over here we have just a pouch of all of our swimming suits. We have Owen's float and I have sister's float in the other bag. And I have a couple swaddle blankets for her for bedtime. And then over here I have the pack and play and the snuggle me here for sister to lounge in. Miss Leota is not coming with unfortunately but she is doing well there. Yes! Yes. Are you going to tuck her in? Tell her good night. Night. <laughs> Very sweet. This is our lovely pile of clothes that we are all going to be putting on in the morning. So they're all just sitting on the table. We have the diaper bag packed with basics and Owen's bag.
All right, we are all packed up, ready for our big NPS trip tomorrow, and we'll see you guys in Nashville. See ya. Bye. Bye.